big story at 10. It is a killer on the lakes and you may not know about blue-green algae. Blue-green algae blooms a few weeks ago and assumed the government was monitoring them, making sure they were safe. It's a type of algae that releases toxins that could affect the resident's health. Turns out the algae blooms are toxic, really, really toxic. There are concentrations of a neurotoxin called microcystine at levels of 18,500 micrograms per liter. Stay out of the water. The blue-green algae can be deadly to animals and cause serious health problems for humans. Okay, so uh, here we are, day one of our research project here. And we just arrived, we're just setting up camp. And uh, th I think it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Yeah. Who, who do we have here? You know me. What's I'm your, Jeff. What's your name? Jeff. And uh, who we got here? I'm Ethan, how you doing? Oh yeah, oh thanks Ethan, yeah. The really good and, looking uh, one, I'm jealous. Uh, Ethan, uh, what are we doing here? Oh, we're just setting up camp, getting ready to uh, head down to the lake here in a few moments. Oh yeah, uh, what do we hope to find there at the lake? Uh, we're really looking for some good blue algae samples. Oh yeah. Uh, so we can do some good research and take it back to the lab later and uh, yeah. work on that. Uh, who do we got here? Right here. I'm Emily Carmichael, but uh, you can call me M. Oh, great, great. Claire. Mm -hmm. Claire is pretty hardcore. Put the like, camera away, Claire. We're gonna do you. Uh, yeah, let's get going. Well, I'm hoping that we find, you know, a really good colony. Okay, right, guys, let's just kind of split up, get our stuff we need, get back to camp, get our research done. So the, the quicker we split up and find some frogs, maybe some grasshoppers, uh, we'll get the beakers, get some of the water, so everyone tests on it. Do you want to fill most of it? Yeah, I'll grab it. We need someone to take okay. some pictures. Okay. Let's uh, let's just get started. Okay. Yeah. All right. Claire. Yeah. I got a frog. Oh, There's a few of them. Go. Yeah, he's oh. there. Oh, Ethan. Let's go show everyone else. Yeah, let's show everyone. I want you to get a frog. Good grab. Let's take him back and like, cut him open. Perfect. Oh, I wish we didn't have to cut him up. I would, you know, try and kiss him. Maybe I'll get a cute prince out of it. You're already in the presence of a prince. What more could you ask oh. for? We should get back and join the rest of the team. That way later on you and I can maybe hang out tonight, hey? That'd be a little fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Jeff. <laughs> what are you, what are you, guys, you gotta be more careful. Let's get back to camp. I'm sorry, Jeff. That's really gross. So here we are now. And uh, how are you feeling? We got I got that crap in my mouth. You had it in your mouth? It was in my mouth. Oh, you, you had it in your sick. mouth? That stuff smelled really what bad. What did it taste like? Uh, just, I don't know what was wrong with that water, but it was gross. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to have some hot dogs for, right, for dinner guys. here. Man, I'm starving. I'm yeah, let's eat. How are you feeling? Yeah. Jeff, you gonna, are you going to have a hot dog? Well. Are you a little mad at them? Well, I'm just, I'm kind of cold to tell you the truth. Just a little, like, I have the chills. You want a blanket? Well, well here. Maybe I'll grab one. Yeah, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah sure, thanks. Kind of super hot out, but yeah. Yeah. So Guys, good. I I don't even know if I can eat. Not feeling yeah, hungry. Hey Jeff, you want a dog? They're ready. Man, like I just I don't know. I'm just not hungry all of a sudden. Guys, I'm I know it's early, but I, I might go to bed. Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed.
I feel obligated to tell you that I think that something is seriously up with Jeff because of the fall into the lake today. Well, it can't be food poisoning because we've pretty much eaten the exact same things he did. We just left this morning driving out. How serious do you think it is? I think it's something serious. Like, it doesn't look good. I think we're just overanalyzing it. Give him till tomorrow morning, let him sleep it off. He'll be fine, we'll be able to get to work and keep doing our research. Well, I guess it doesn't hurt to wait till tomorrow. I guess. And yeah, we'll see. Hey guys, let's go, we gotta get up. Jeff's already up, let's get going. Right. He slept in. What time is it? not feeling any better from yesterday then. I have no energy. I must have eaten something really bad a couple days ago or something. I don't know what it is. What do you want us to do? Well, if you, you, guys, if you guys get more meal? samples and stuff, I'll, I'll work extra hard in the lab when we get back to the city. You guys go get more samples. Right? I'll stay here. Okay, so let us know if anything happens. Yeah, for sure. The photosynthesis is interesting here. It seems, it seems like the algae is a little bit irregular. Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Not sure if that's due to the algae or or any of those things. I, I won't know until I get it under a microscope later. I think we got some really good samples here, guys. Like I think we can head back uh, probably even today, maybe a little bit more this afternoon. That way we can yeah. get Jeff home, get him checked out. It is lunchtime anyway, so we should probably yeah, head back to the back. camp, see how the other two are doing. I think we got some really solid samples, but uh, M and Ethan and I, were, we just came down to find the last bit of the samples and yeah, uh, Jeff's really not feeling well, so I'm glad we got it done because I think we really do need to get him back into the city. You ready for lunch? Fun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, weird. It's all empty. Where here. are the other two? So when we came out here, I kind of just thought this was going to be, you know, a boring old project we were researching, but I really do think that this is growing too fast and may actually affect more than we thought. The fire is not even lit and they didn't even make lunch or anything. It doesn't look like anybody's been here. Well, there's some hot dogs and stuff still over there and I think... Oh, there's Claire. Claire's over there. Hey, Claire, are you coming to eat lunch? We're ready to eat. I'll go there. Claire, there you are. We're looking for you. It doesn't look like you guys have been there all morning. I was, where's Jeff? Oh, hey Hoff, how'd the video go? Oh, really good, got some nice stuff on there. Where is everyone? I don't know, we got back to the camp and they were gone. Then uh, M went to look for the other. <laughs> Stay here. <laughs> M, M, what's wrong? What happened? Are you okay? M, Claire, what's going on? <laughs>
alive. Something happened to everyone back there. They started attacking me. Something must have gone wrong with the blue algae. I don't know what happened, but I've got to get back in the city and get some help. I don't know what happened back there. Finally made it into the city. Not feeling so well. I noticed this terrible cut. I finally made it in here at the hospital. Hopefully, I can get it checked out.